this is this is a turn up for the book, isn't it? Me writing lists. <laughs> um, but we have a very special guest coming. In about ten hours. He is at the moment travelling by train from beep 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 to Lasso Terrain. And um, we're just writing a list for the things that we want him to do. And I think you know who he is. So yes, this this man we love so dearly, um, Cardinal Full Sang Nielsen, is decided not because of what happened last time with the the airplanes and everything like that and he getting very stressed because of the airplanes and i think it's you know he's perfectly within his rights to get stressed um he uh he's decided to take a train from uh i think it's Colm where he lives Colm is it sounds you know um, in denmark is the nearest town to him and then all the way through um, on the train, 15 hours on a train to La Souterraine and about 8 o'clock tonight I should go and pick him up. I might make him walk because <laughs> let's face it, he's been on a train he's been sitting on his backside for 15 hours. <laughs> so, <laughs> you know, you need the exercise. His legs won't work. So yeah, no, we'll, we'll go and pick him up and uh, it will be great to see him and he's here for the week and so I, you know, I know what will happen tomorrow morning at seven o'clock, he will be up, ready and rearing to go. So I have to make my list so we can get it done. And it's a fair old list. Hopefully we'll get some stuff done. So that's, that's the list as far as it goes. Um, I would love to see a lot of those on TikTok. I wonder how we get on. <laughs> I wonder how we'll get on. Right, do you want to go through the list? I know we will get a load done, but whether it's this is another matter. But whatever that man does for us is just priceless. So let's go through this lot, shall we? We haven't taken the tent down because we've used it as a wardrobe. And we have and no now, time. And now we, yeah. And now we've got a bedroom with um, little chest of drawers, drawers, and, and all that sort of thing that I've made. We can now sort that out. That will probably be me today and then us tomorrow morning. That will definitely get done. More on the bathroom wall. That's down to a, um, La Chef. Um, again, I think that's a good one for the two of them to, to get together while I make uh, other bits and pieces that I need and do some surveying. Once the tent's down, we can do some surveying and what we've got to do later down here. So we've got to clear the back of the stable block because there is a little tiny window in there that's going to be dropped out to the floor so we can then dig out. So we haven't got to dig underneath the wall where we put the waste pipe in. So, as I say, drop out the wall is number four. I dig the trench out for the 100mm water pipe, uh, waste pipe. Stack my firewood that my lovely neighbour, Philip, turned up with. When he said he was going to turn up with it in September, he turned up with it in the back end of August. And there's a big pile of wood out there that needs stacking. Otherwise, it's going to get wet, mouldy, and horrible. Chain shore up the old wood. The stuff that Carsten is going to hate us because he moved a load of stuff last time he was here. And we cleaned, cleared areas and all this sort of thing. And it's been left there because we just haven't physically got the time to, to deal with it. But if we can get to deal with that, Chainsaw it all up because some of it you're never going to use for anything else apart from firewood. So let's see if we can do that. That will be a big bonus because then the, the stacking will be great. Um, where are we? So the bath waste. I put in the bath waste and schoolboy error did a wrong, wrong thing and it needs to come out. So we're going to take that out and put no money in. Lay the pipe work in for the 100 mil. So we need to lay it in, see if we've got a nice fall. That is my problem, to see if we've got a, a, a nice fall, and this is above why we had to dig that old run out. The back wall needs plasterboarding, but it can't be done until the mortaring has been done. And the last one is 
if we haven't got a fall on our waste pipe, we need to, we're going to have to raise the bathroom floor, which again, it's not a great big job, but it's one of those jobs that would be brilliant if there's two of you. And by getting all this done, that really gets us prepared for getting the bathroom done, doesn't it? Well, my, my issue, my thing, um, is that if we get the septic tank in, we, there is, n and yeah, there is nothing that's stopping us to finish that, that place by the time we've given ourselves to finish it. The septic tank, if we can get the good weather, we've got good weather this week, um, if we've got some good weather next week, I'm hoping that my um, Belgian neighbour, Mr. Gunter, uh, who you will know from a concrete flooring, is going to come and use the midi pellet to dig holes so we can put a micro station in. I need to do some research into micro stations, so while Cast is here, I think you know, it might be an idea that we sit down and see if we can research them uh, to get all the bits. And perhaps we need to go with somebody who can explain this sort of situation um, to France Bonhomme, because that's probably where we'll get all our stuff from, and uh, buy all the bits so we can get that and then we can fit it all and i think we can fit it ourselves it's not it's not rocket science cool rock on carlston start of a new morning and look who's here hello <laughs> that was a bit weak carlston hello <laughs> <laughs> Seven, 17 hours on a train mm. yep. what a nutter 17 hours all, all the way from Colin to, to, to La Soudre. Freak, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and nearly missing the train about yeah, seven times. Yeah. Nearly getting arrested in Frankfurt. That's another story. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, private. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but he's here. Yeah. And he's ready to go. Ready right. to work. What so, is the plan of action? So this is what he's ready to do. That's your list of jobs. <laughs> yeah. I guess uh, you have and, another and one. Was, <laughs> and what was it your wife said? What are you going to do after Sunday? Tomorrow, yes. <laughs> <laughs> but, right, uh, your wife knows you from old. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so we've got the list. What is the plan of action for day one? Day one is the first one, 10 down. Um, we're going to get this all all cleared out today. This, this, this bit all cleared out today. It won't take... We've got a few things on. Obviously, the restaurant's open. So... Um, and yeah, things are in the way. So if we get this all down and all cleared and we can have a look at when we start pulling that out. What I also would like to do as well is go around the back and strim the back if the weather's good so we can get in to this. Behind here is a little window, like one of these windows here. And we need to drop the wall out. That doesn't take long as we know, because we've done that before. Have um, a time. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so once we've done that, if we get to that stage today... You'll be happy. Well happy. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, let's mm -hmm. go for it then. Go. Day one. Day one. Day one. Shall I put this up just so you, yeah, well, you don't... Re so, a little reminder. Oh, no, no, no.
So it's the end of another era. After three years of living in and out of this tent in different locations on the estate, it was time to pack it away. I wouldn't say for good, because you never know what's around the corner. So this is the area the tent was in. The tent is down. We've got no tent. And uh, it really exposes the room again, which is absolutely brilliant. This is going to be the kitchen. So the bathroom through there and the entrance to where the bedroom is. And um, this is all going to be the kitchen. So the aim at the moment is they're going to drop this wall out because they need to install waste pipe, water pipes that are going to go from here all the way through the ground, through this wall and out to where the faucetique will be. But this wall, because they don't have foundations in France, the walls just go right down to the ground. We don't know how far it goes down. So the easiest option is to drop part of this wall out, install the pipe, rebuild the wall back up. So that's what they're doing at the moment. Putting the acros in to make sure it's safe. There's Carsten oh, out the other side. Morning, Carsten. Oh, good morning. Do you already feel you like you've done a day's work? No. It's only 10 o'clock. I think I lost a kilo already. <laughs> yeah. Good? Uh, yeah. Oh. yeah, it says I wind my bit up here. It, may, it needs to be tight. Um, so, the achievement of today, hopefully, is to drop this wall out um, and start having a look at where we can dig out here. Um, I also want to do some measurements um, and see what the fall's like to see how much I've got to bring the bathroom floor out. I've resigned myself to the fact that the bathroom floor's got to come up. Um, so let's do that. Let's not muck about, let's just do it. Yep. Carson, how are you feeling with the day's work? I think it's wonderful. It's great. It's straightforward working. <laughs> it's just no, a good no plan. About, yeah. There's a good and big plan. <laughs> and it's great. Brilliant. Yeah. And at the moment, I don't think you can see, but Colson's actually standing in the middle of a, a load of overgrowth. Sort of a jungle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to clear the, the greens for so there's a space for working here. As Lisa said, we're taking, taking this down, so I need a little space. Are you happy to be here, Colson? I love it. As always, I simply <laughs> love it. How are you getting on, baby? Um, it's doing, doing really well. Um, what have my, you got done since the last four years? Uh, so we last saw, you probably, I don't know if you saw the, the big hole in the wall. No. But there's a big hole in the wall. Um, I leave him for five minutes, there's a big hole in my walls. Um, I'll have him to bits because of it, because it saves me having to do it. But what we've done is we dug a trench to put our waste pipe in as well as digging a big hole out of the wall. Um, so that's where the window was, and we dropped that out. Carsten has dropped that out. And then we dug this channel, taking all the stone out this way, dug the channel so we can put our waste pipe in. At the moment, what we're trying to do 
is just level it out to see how much, if anything, we need to raise the bathroom floor. I think we do need to raise the bathroom floor. I personally think it'd be quite nice, again, to step down from the kitchen into the bathroom, down into the bedroom. I think it's just really nice to give levels. Um, so yeah, we're just trying to sort of see how much we can get away with on this. Um, and then when that's set, that's fine. That'll be where the waste pipe goes. And then out this way, we will get some fellow I know with a little digger and come around and dig the trenches, which will take us out into the Fossepti. So brilliant. I think it's a brilliant day's work already just to lay that in. My, my thought is I would love to go and lay the floor in and get the pipe work in situ from this to do that. I said, that's a, that'll be a major thing. Then you could mortar, we could plasterboard and we'd be done. well down the road. I think it's, it's a good start to the week, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Look yeah. at his face. I'm satisfied. <laughs> good. good, I'm glad. So after day one of Carsten's visit, we were sprinting along. The tent had come down, the wall had been dropped out, and the trench had been dug ready for the water pipe. We were knocking those jobs off the list like there's no tomorrow. Let's see what the next day brings. Join us next time. If you would like to hit a ride with us on this adventure, then please check out our Patreon page. For just five euros a month, you can help support our project, receive behind the scenes footage, uncut videos and have Zoom chats with me and Ted. Be part of the Monmania family on our patron-only Facebook page or make a one-off donation via our PayPal page. All of the links are in the description. You will then know that your contribution helps to preserve a piece of world history. Yeah.